Serpents in history represent a creative life force, transformation, and innovation. And the hydra is a part serpent creature. In Greek mythology, if you cut one of the heads of the hydra off, two more grow back in its place. Uh, this really represents the growth of Florida Poly over time. We're living in, well, Lakeland. And since it, this was a serpent, the hydra is pretty much residing in anything that is water-based, so like lakes. And we're also using any of the man-made lakes that we're out here at our Florida Poly campus to help us kind of correlate this idea and make it more of a, a strong, realistic kind of concept for everybody. And uh, we're using this as our mission statement tied into it. Uh, our hydro would have four heads, one for each of the concentrations like science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. We were also thinking about if we add a fifth head, we can make that centralized around clubs or organizations, or once we get Greek life going, we can have that represent their own fraternity or sorority. Another thing we had for the representation uh, actually at the school, I uh, had an idea for a statue that would be incorporated in the lakes. Um, coming down each lock, there would be a, a lump of the hydra, and then over this last walkway, there would be one arch coming over the walkway that you can actually walk under. So one of the ideas that we had come up with as a group was anytime someone at the school gets something patented, we add a scale onto the bottom, the belly of the hydra, with their name and their patent on it. We came up with a couple designs, like Devante said earlier on the story that we would like to get a mascot um, that we get tattooed on and not regret it. We came up with our own creative solutions, so we came up with these, uh, a serious version and a more cartoonish version. 